Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if you are new, and welcome back to Vlogmas Day 8. Today, we have a lot of festive things planned. First, starting off with the fact that I'm wearing more of Rarity Dogme's holiday merch. Also, I have my Starbucks Christmas mug for my coffee today, and I am currently drinking 20 ounces of coffee. Am I ashamed? No, not really. So today, we have a lot of festive things planned, starting with, you know, making some chocolate-covered pretzels. We're gonna make some dairy-free hot cocoa mitts, watch some Christmas movies. If you guys have not seen any of the other Vlogmas vlogs, don't forget to check out the Vlogmas 21 playlist down below in the description box. And now it is time to go find food. And also today for Rarity.me's holiday launch, I am wearing the Merry Christmas tee. So it's a cute little Merry Christmas design with snowflakes and a little Santa hat. It is super cute. So if you like to snag one, don't forget to check out the link down below in the description box. And also, I have been getting a lot of questions on what my jewelry is from. So I am wearing the Star Necklace from Adam and Matter in rose gold. I definitely love it. Every single day I wear it. So if you guys want to check that out, I will also have Adam and Matters link down below in the description box. Currently on my laptop I am stabilizing clips for one of the other Vlogmas vlogs and it's taking forever but this one is finally at 23% and I think this is the last one that I have to stabilize on this vlog but don't quote me on that. We're getting ready to make some chocolate covered pretzels. So of course, these are the Glutino gluten-free pretzel twists and they are non-dairy, no soy, no egg, and no artificial colors or flavors. It is also non-GMO certified. And then as for chocolates, we have Nestle Toll House allergen-free white morsels. We have two packages. They were clearly on sale. And then we have the Enjoy Life morsels in dark chocolate, which are also allergy friendly. And then we got this sprinkle mitt. So in this sprinkle mitt, there's all these different kinds of sprinkles in here, Christmas colors. And then the recipe says to use some shortening. So this is the butter flavor shortening. Why not? And we're going to use all of this to make some delicious chocolate covered pretzels. Apparently allergy free like faux white chocolate doesn't work the same uh, as dairy based white chocolate y'all. No mom you did that! So that's a number 9. Yeah and that's a number 8. Also we bammed them like emerald. <laughs> you know. Bam. <laughs> Plan B. Sprinkles on top. We'll put the sprinkles in first. And then what? Hey. The extra white chocolate and then put the pretzel inside of it? Or we could put the pretzel in. Oh we should put the pretzel in then the. Yeah okay. happened the white chocolate wasn't behaving so we put sprinkles in the bottom of the chocolate mold and then broke a piece of pretzel and then filled it up with the misbehaving white chocolate stuck them in the freezer that's cute and now you have a chocolate covered pretzel sprinkle candy thingy now it is time to put all of the Christmas holiday inventory that is over yonder on my desk. And we're going to put it in my under bed storage container so that that's done. And then after that, I think we're going to figure out what we're doing for dinner. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy I'm about to make the gluten-free and dairy-free hot cocoa mix. So this is where the recipe is from. Gluten-free, I'm not going to try to say that. But the ingredients is two cups granulated sugar, one cup of unsweetened cocoa, 
and half a cup of non-fat dry milk, but I will show you guys what I'm using instead. One teaspoon of salt and two teaspoons of vanilla bean powder. So instead of doing that milk alternative that they were talking about, I use this. This is from H-E-B. It's organic coconut milk powder, and it says right on the package, dairy-free and gluten-free. And then as for the cocoa powder that I use, I use Hershey's Cocoa Special Dark 100% Cacao. And then for the vanilla bean powder, I use this Cook's Pure Powder Vanilla. And these seem to work really well. I love them all together. And then I will also be grinding up some candy canes to put in the hot cocoa. I just made a mess with the whipped cream. I just got it all over the stove, but hey, my hot cocoa looks cute. I cannot express how happy this evening has made me so even though I slept in super duper late like today pleased me today was happy today was a great day it was exciting it was packed with fun even though it was only a few holiday activities it just makes me so happy the only thing that can make me happier this time of year is to be with my family back in Wisconsin if you guys enjoyed today's video and you're enjoying vlogmas of 2021 this year please don't forget to subscribe turn on post notifications and to give this video a smack and thumbs up so you don't miss a future vlogmas vlog and if you guys have by chance missed any of the vlogmas vlogs the vlogmas 2021 playlist will be linked down below in the description box i love you guys so much thank you so much for watching this video and supporting vlogmas for 2021 and with that being said i will see you guys in my next vlogmas vlog bye